Pinot Noir, it's, um, it's the Burgundy grape variety and it's a, it's a big, big family of grape variety and uh, there is a, uh, a collection that has been done recently for, uh, by 100 domains in Burgundy including, I mean, all the big, big names and uh, they collected 3,000 different types of Pinot Noir and uh, the idea is uh, that Pinot Noir, there's a mutation of each grape variety on, its, on the soil and the climate, and the, on also because the way people work the vines, there is that's a notion of evolution. So just talking about Pinot Noir is kind of wrong. And uh, so when you taste a very, very, very good bottle of Pinot Noir, there's a notion of terroir. There's also a notion of quality of the plant, and that is very, very well known in, in Burgundy. And it's why winemakers always try to to. To, when you, you have a very good wine, you reproduce, you take the, the Pinot Noir from that land. It's not especially the best land, it's actually the best plant. And that makes a big difference. And sometimes you can drink some Premier Cru, which will be better than a Grand Cru, because actually the quality of the plant are better. And um, so that's also uh, something which is, I mean, in general, nobody talks about that, because, I mean, the appellation are kind of very well established. And uh, it's and it's very difficult to to explain because it's uh, I mean we have already far too much information on a bottle of wine so it's quite difficult to, to say it's one of these three thousand Pinot Noir so it's uh, we like to for as a marketing point of view simplify the the Pinot Noir.